In this lesson, learn how to create your Sage account. If you are an employee who receives an invitation, the first step is to download the mobile app from the Google Play or App Store. In the previous lesson, you saw the invitation in a web browser. Sage recommends you download the app, create the Sage account, accept the invitation, and complete the app settings on the device where the app will reside. Here is the invitation in format on the cell phone. You should be able to tap the download link for the appropriate app store. If this takes you to a browser rather than the App Store or Google Play, open the store and search for Sage 100 Contractor Time. The app is free to download. After the download is complete, open the app. The first time you do this, you must log in or create a Sage account. This is the account the app uses to allow access to the database through the connection in the app settings. This is by user and not related to the Sage account you use when you contact support. In the Sage 100 Contractor Time login screen, tap the Sage button. A message displays to confirm that Sage 100 Contractor Time can use Sage.com to sign in. Tap Continue to accept. If you have a Sage account, type the email and password for the account. If this is the first time you connect to a Sage mobile app, you need to create a new account, so tap Create Account. The Sage account is how the program establishes a user's digital identity and authenticates them for use. You do not pay for the Sage account you set up here. The Sage account is a conduit to provide access to the back office from the mobile app. Type the email you want to use, your first name and last name, and then type the password. Confirm the password. Keep a note of these somewhere in case you need to re-enter this information in the future. Normally, the app connects through the Sage account automatically when you log in to Sage 100 Contractor Time. Tap Sign Up to continue. A verification email is sent to the email you used with a verification code. Type the code and tap Verify Email. The next screen you see is the settings in the mobile app. At this point, the Sage account is created and you continue with the next steps. In this lesson, you learned how to create your Sage account. Continue to the next lesson to learn about the process to accept the invitation and complete the settings to connect to your company data in the mobile app.